Hand Washing vs. Hand Sanitizer This is part of our free coronavirus campaign knowing when it's best to wash your hands. And when hand sanitizers can be helpful. Is key to protecting yourself from the coronavirus as well as other illnesses. Like the common cold and seasonal flu. While both serve a purpose, washing your hands with soap and water should always be a priority. According to the CDC. Only use hand sanitizer if your soap and water isn't available in a given situation. It's also important to always wash your hands. After going to the bathroom. After blowing your nose, coughing, or sneezing. Before eating. After touching surfaces that could be contaminated. The CDC lists specific instructions trusted source on the most effective way to wash your hands. This is what they recommend. Always use clean, running water. It can be warm or cold. Wet your hands first, then turn the water off, and lather your hands with soap. Rub your hands together with the soap for at least 20 seconds. Make sure to scrub the back of your hands, between your fingers and under your nails. Turn the water on and rinse your hands. Use a clean towel or air dry. The bottom line hand sanitizer is a handy on the go way to help prevent the spread of germs when soap and water isn't available. Alcohol-based hand sanitizers can help keep you safe and reduce the spread of the novel coronavirus. If you are having a hard time finding hand sanitizer at your local stores and hand washing isn't available, you can take steps to make your own. You only need a few ingredients, such as rubbing alcohol, aloe vera gel, and an essential oil or lemon juice. Although hand sanitizers can be an effective way of getting rid of germs, Health authorities still recommend hand washing whenever possible to keep your hands free of disease-causing viruses and other germs. You can also watch our video content on YouTube on how to make your own hand sanitizer at home in 10 minutes with our source coming from WHO World Health Organization. Special thanks to Healthline and WHO World Health Organization. If you like this video, kindly subscribe on our channel for more quality video like this. Like, share and leave your comment below. This video was brought to you by VicPoint. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at RealVicPoint. Thank you.